Just a century ago, humanity's understanding of the universe was astonishingly limited. Many astronomers genuinely believed that all of creation was contained within the Milky Way galaxy. Our home was the universe, and beyond its stars lay only darkness. But in 1928, Edwin Hubble shattered that illusion. With precise measurements of distant galaxies, he proved that the cosmos was not static, it was expanding. This revelation transformed science forever, opening the door to an entirely new vision of the universe. Then, decades later in 1997, the Hubble Space Telescope made another discovery that shook the foundations of cosmology. The expansion of the universe wasn't slowing down as expected. It was accelerating, driven by a mysterious force we now call dark energy. This invisible hand of the cosmos became one of the great enigmas of science, and it led to the current estimate of the universe's age, 13.8 billion years. But today, thanks to the James Webb Space Telescope, that timeline may be falling apart. Deep within our Milky Way lies a stellar enigma known as M92, a dense cluster of ancient stars that has left scientists baffled. The problem is simple, yet deeply unsettling. M92 appears to be just as old as the universe itself. Some measurements even suggest it could be older. How is this possible? Stars cannot predate the cosmos. And yet, the data whispers otherwise. Astronomers have simulated more than 20,000 synthetic star populations to refine its age, but each calculation pushes uncomfortably close to the supposed beginning of everything. Which raises a haunting question. Have we been wrong about the universe's timeline all along? Enter the James Webb Space Telescope, the most advanced eye humanity has ever turned toward the heavens. Webb has looked deeper than ever before, uncovering galaxies formed just 300 million years after the Big Bang. But here's the paradox. These galaxies are too large, too complex, and too mature for their age. According to every model we have, they shouldn't exist. Could it be that the universe is much older than we think? Or has our entire framework of cosmic evolution been flawed from the very beginning? A radical new hypothesis is now on the table. What if the universe isn't 13.8 billion years old, but closer to 26.7 billion? This staggering idea suggests that our interpretation of cosmic expansion, star formation, and galaxy evolution may be incomplete, or worse, fundamentally broken. From ancient anomalies like the so-called Methuselah star to the impossibly mature galaxies Webb has spotted, the evidence is piling up. Something doesn't fit. The Methuselah star, officially known as HD 140283, has long puzzled astronomers. Its estimated age? Around 14.5 billion years. That would make it older than the universe itself, according to current models. How could a star exist before creation? Stars follow predictable life cycles, dictated by mass and chemistry, yet Methuselah appears to be burning slower than time itself. It isn't just an anomaly, it's a cosmic warning sign, pointing toward mysteries far beyond our grasp. At the center of this debate lies the Hubble constant, the number that defines how fast the universe is expanding. But here's the problem, it refuses to agree with itself. Measurements of the early universe, drawn from the cosmic microwave background, suggest a slower rate of 68 kilometers per second per megaparsec. But local measurements of nearby stars and galaxies point to a faster rate, closer to 73. This, Hubble tension, has become one of the most pressing mysteries in astrophysics. If we can't agree on the universe's expansion rate, how can we possibly measure its age with confidence? James Webb has only added fuel to the fire. By peering into the so-called dark ages of the universe, the time before the first stars were born, Webb has uncovered galaxies far too massive for their place in the timeline. 
Galaxies comparable in size and structure to the Milky Way, existing just a few hundred million years after the Big Bang. According to our textbooks, they would need billions of years to form. And yet, there they are, staring back at us through Webb's golden mirrors. Some scientists now whisper what was once unthinkable. What if the Big Bang model itself is incomplete? What if the universe didn't begin in a single explosive moment, but is instead part of a much larger, stranger reality? This brings us to radical possibilities. Some researchers suggest that our universe may not be alone. The multiverse theory proposes that countless universes could exist side by side, each with its own laws of physics, its own timelines, and its own beginnings and endings. If this is true, then anomalies like Methuselah or Webb's ancient galaxies might be the fingerprints of other dimensions brushing against our own. Could the James Webb telescope be giving us the first glimpse into these neighboring realms? If so, the implications stretch far beyond astronomy. They challenge the very nature of reality. Another theory gaining traction is the idea of a cyclic universe. Instead of a single beginning, the cosmos may have gone through endless cycles of expansion and collapse, big bangs followed by big crunches over and over again. Could Webb's ancient galaxies be echoes from a previous cycle? Ghosts of a universe that lived and died before ours? Adding to the mystery is the role of primordial black holes. Formed in the earliest moments after the Big Bang, these strange objects could have served as anchors for early galaxies, accelerating their formation. Webb's discoveries may be indirect evidence of their existence. But if primordial black holes are real, they not only change our understanding of galaxy evolution, they force us to rethink the very nature of the universe's birth. And then there is dark energy, the mysterious force driving cosmic acceleration. For years, scientists assumed it was constant. But what if it isn't? What if dark energy changes over time, altering the universe's expansion in ways we can't yet predict? If that's true, it could explain the rapid appearance of Webb's impossible galaxies, and why the universe looks older than we think. But it also opens the door to even deeper questions. What if time itself is not as rigid as we believe? What if it bends, shifts, or breaks down entirely at the smallest scales? Quantum theories suggest that the early universe may have experienced bizarre fluctuations, bursts of energy capable of spawning galaxies, altering the flow of time, or even giving rise to multiple universes. From the time distortion near black holes to the strange mathematics of the Big Bang, Webb's discoveries are forcing us to confront the possibility that time and space are not what they seem. The James Webb Space Telescope has not simply expanded our view of the universe, it has shaken the very foundations of cosmology. From stars that appear older than the cosmos, to galaxies that should not exist, the evidence is mounting that the story we've been telling about the universe is incomplete. But this isn't just about age, numbers, or equations. It's about something far more profound. Each new discovery Webb delivers reminds us of one truth. The universe is stranger than we ever imagined. What if it isn't 13.8 billion years old, but 26.7 billion? What if it has no age at all, existing in endless cycles? What if our universe is just one of countless others, each telling its own cosmic story? One thing is certain, the James Webb Space Telescope is not just a machine. It is a time traveler. A cosmic storyteller. A key to the secrets of existence itself. With every image it sends back, it forces us to dream bigger, question deeper, and embrace the unknown. So what do you think? Are we standing at the edge of a cosmic revolution, one that will rewrite everything we know about time, space, and reality itself? Let us know your thoughts below, and if you want more journeys into the mysteries of the cosmos, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. The universe is only just beginning to reveal its secrets.